Well, Abby, talk, talk about credentials. He won a gold medal for Ukraine. You're absolutely right. And now he helps coach the men's gymnastics team there at OU. And he told us in an exclusive interview what the past few days have been like for him, knowing his brothers and their families are near the front lines of this war. Coach Valerie Gontarov spends his days helping coach the OU men's gymnastics team, one of the best in the country. This is a really great place, you know. But Coach Gancharov grew up far from Sooner Nation. It's not easy because your thoughts always uh, right there now in Ukraine. He's from Kharkiv, one of the places in the middle of the war. Ukrainian people are great people, uh, hardworking, um, friendly. Many of his family members still there. I have two brothers, yeah, one of them in uh, Kharkov. One of them in uh, Vinica. Yeah, they have also families and kids. Yeah. I talked to my brother yesterday, and one of one of bombs just exploded by his house. Yeah, and it's it's tough. It was impossible to imagine that it could happen. You know. Uh, Impossible to imagine that this could happen in a country he loves so much, a country he was proud to represent. Yes, I've, I've competed for Ukrainian national team. Uh, I'm three times Olympian, I'm Olympic champion. Uh, it's a great feeling when, uh, when you're on podium and uh, you get your medal in your neck and you see your flag and your, everybody can stand up and listen to your anthem. It's a great feeling. This is Coach Valery Goncharov's message tonight. Stop that war in Ukraine now and stop people suffering. Main idea is, is really to stop kill each other. Is stop shooting, stop killing. And we want to say thank you so much for him taking the time to share what has been obviously a, a painful few days. We really appreciate hearing his thoughts. And guys, I hate to report late breaking tonight. The first major city in Ukraine appears to have fallen. The major city of Kherson, according to the mayor there, now indicating the city has fallen under Russian control.